so the first thing you need to do is to go to your whatsapp and you to uninstall your whatsapp which i'm going to do here so once you have done that the next thing is you go to your google drive and then to your account then you go to backups and you make sure you turn off the backup now for this my email there's nothing like backup but once i enter the second one you come to backups so you can see once you have any of your accounts that has a whatsapp backup you are going to see it listed here then what you are going to do is to turn it off here once you click here you see where you an option is because i've turned this one off already so that's why the option is not there so you tap here and then you are going to see where you are going to turn it off there's no need to delete the backup if you don't want to but if you want to delete it you can still go ahead and delete it so once you have done these two now next you go to your play store and then you reinstall your whatsapp now once you have installed your whatsapp you open it and then you do what it needs for Now, once you get to this part, right, you wait a little bit. Once you get to this part, make sure you don't touch anything. So you minimize, and then you go straight to where you keep your backup. Now, this is where I stored all my backup. Now, everything is here, right? You can see. So if you come to your Android, then you come to your media, then you come to com.whatsapp, you'll find out that it's empty. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy everything here inside here and then you can see in case you only have your backup file or your database file you can create inside of your com.whatsapp you can create a folder with this exact name whatsapp then inside of it you can create this folder with this exact name databases then if you enter inside of it you can see my database my message database here so what I'm going to do now is to copy the whole of this one here I'm going to copy it. Media, com dot WhatsApp, and paste it here. So now, once I'm done, once I'm done, I'm going to off my data, and then I'm going to enter here and then i'm going to go ahead and give it permission now once it shows you this just click any area of the screen it's going to go off now make sure you leave it to do this for a while now once you have allowed it to do this for a while for some few seconds then you can now go ahead and then put on your data back now you can see it has picked up my backup restore your messages and media from your phone internal storage if you don't restore now you won't be able to restore later so you go ahead and restore so you can see now it's now restoring my chat from my local storage so you make sure you adhere to this so thank you for watching this video please don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also to share thank you and have a blessed day